Hi guys, this is Carol. I am still I I am so blind. The the uh, lens thing is in the black part of my phone, and I cannot see where it is. And I never remember to look until I'm here. Sorry, <laughs> I'm trying to look at you. I just don't know where to look. Anyway, this is June thirtieth. I know the day today. It's Tuesday. I can't believe June is over. This year's, in some ways, it's going by super slow. In some ways, it's going by super fast. But anyway, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. I, let me tell you what I have in the works, though. I'm going to do a series on the little town in New Mexico where I grew up. My sister used to be curator of a museum in New Mexico. She's helping me gather some facts that I can share with you. So, her name's Linda. Thank you, Linda. And... Uh, it'll have to be more than one video because you know it takes me a lot of words to say anything and it's an interesting place. But today we're going to do Dollar Tree because I've got it in the bags and mine as well. Okay. Oh, and then I have plans to do a Route 66 series and I'm going to take you to see this big hole in the ground by me just down the road. Okay. So, stay tuned, guys. Uh, we went to Dollar Tree for one thing. I wanted encouragement cards to send to my friend, Elise, that I told you has cancer. Went in for the one thing. Wait till you see what I got. <laughs> my granddaughter went in with me. She saw these, and she just had to have a new water bottle. So, she got totally. teal for her and... Mwah. Blue for her brother, which is not in this bag. Uh, while I was there, I thought I might as well get aluminum foil because it's the cheapest place to buy aluminum foil. She found this, and she wanted it, and then she decided she'd give it to her brother because we only found one, but no, it's... it's ours. It's ours? Oh, now it's ours. <laughs> her and her brother's. Growing crystals. But there's two rocks in there I guess they can share. Uh... When my grandson is here, he sleeps on an air mattress in the floor. It's a navy blue air mattress, and it got a leak in it. And so we had red duct tape, so we put red duct tape over the hole. Well, in the middle of the night last night, the dogs pulled the red duct tape off. It had already started peeling off in a spot, and I'm sure they could see that. Oh, sorry, sticking out. And they decided just to take it on off for us. <laughs> and he woke up in the middle of the night with his air mattress flat as a pancake. <laughs> so I got navy blue duct tape, thinking maybe the dogs wouldn't be able to see this on the air mattress. And then this, I'm real excited about. I've seen on numerous people's hauls these little knives that they get from Dollar Tree. I saw a box of them down there, and so I got me two. Then I went up to check out, and the lady checking me out said, oh, those knives are so good and sharp, and they're perfect for cutting potatoes. So I went back and got three more I'm going to share with Casey for her birthday. Casey's birthday is July 13th, and uh, sorry, my nose itches. I gather things up all through the year to fix her uh, my kids' goodie bags. Then I got some paint because I lost my other white paint. And I'm trying to make a uh, uh, plain vanilla grandma little sign thing. So I got some more white paint. I got parchment paper because the cheapest place to get parchment paper. I got a gift bag. My granddaughter picked this out for Casey and I thought it was beautiful. And we're just going to fill it full of stuff for Casey. We got bath puffs for the kids to have here at my house. More aluminum foil. A puzzle, because they like puzzles and I love Toy Story. Woody. <laughs> I have to tell you this. I may have already told you this story, but I have to tell you again. Anytime I see anything remotely related to Toy Story, I think about my two oldest grandsons. They are... Mason and Travis? That's my only other grandsons yet. <laughs> One just turned 19, and the other will be 21 in the fall. 
I can't believe he's going to be 21. But when they were itty bitty boys is when Toy Story first came out. And we watched it. We had it on DVD and we watched it every day. Well, um, the youngest of those two grandsons, my daughter Becky has the two boys. Uh, Travis could not... Uh, he didn't. He he couldn't say some letters, and when he was little, he called everybody Travis. <laughs> uh, he knew his name was Travis, but he thought everybody else's name was Travis too. I don't know what. It used to irritate me to death. We were always saying, "No, Travis, this is Toby." <laughs> you know, whatever it was. Well, one time they were like. I don't know, two and three or three and four. Uh, Travis had gone up to his brother Mason and said, said, Twavis, something. He, he, he pronounced his name Twavis, Twavis. <laughs> he said Twavis to his brother and then just started telling him something. And I said, Mason, please tell Travis what your real name is. <laughs> and so... My oldest grandson, Mason, he could make his eyes look like precious moment, big old teardrop eyes. I don't know how, but they looked exactly like that. He went up next to his brother and put his arm around his shoulder like this. And he said, he couldn't say Travis either. He said, Travis, my real name is Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that cracks me up. His real name is Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> Anyway, I got more sponge brushes oh, to... I never heard that story. You either. never heard that story? I got sponge, brush, sponge brushes to stain my table that Casey made for me. Taylor, they have a big wood selection of things that you can paint. Taylor got a unicorn for her to paint. No, it's a unicorn. It's a unicorn. What? Unicorn. I said unicorn. We got a little birdhouse for my grandson to paint. Here's his water bottle she chose for him. He didn't go in with us. It was just me and Taylor. And then I saw somebody else do a Walmart, a Dollar Tree haul, and they had these highlighters, and they were so pretty. I just had to have some, although I have no need for a highlighter, but I'll use it in my coloring books. And then... The, the white paint I got, I'm going to write plain vanilla grandma on this and do something with it. I found this little notebook that says, girl, you got this. <laughs> I want to send this to my friend Elise, the, the one I told you has cancer. Quit getting in my video. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, <laughs> I want to send this to my friend that has cancer because I am going to... Oh, Talk her through this. She's going to be a survivor. Ow, so I got Grandma. envelopes to mail it in. Grandma, Mommy said we could be in your video if we just, like, pop in. Okay. Then I got this for me because I want to label. Mommy said we could be in it. I want to label plastic boxes. I saw this lady's pantry. <laughs> and it was beautiful. Every single thing was in one of those clear buckets with a handle. You could pull it out, and she had just everything in those. And it, so, it looked so neat and tidy. So I got me a bunch of clear plastic shoe boxes and some bigger boxes to put things in. I put all my baking things in one plastic box. You know, my... Um, and I also got this, Grandma. That's my clay. I just okay. took it out. Uh, I put, you know, like measuring spoons, measuring cups, uh, sifter, uh, baking cups, like muffin liners. I got everything that involves baking, I put in one plastic thing. So I'm going to write baking on this and tape it to it. I've got one that's just cooking spices. Um, I don't know what all else I'm going to do, but I'm, I want to do that. So anyway, I got that from me. I like to label things and put them in alphabetical order. And then, this is what I really went in for. Um, I wanted to get my friend Elise some 
encouragement card. So I got this one. This one. I thought some soup and quackers would make you feel better. And this one says, I'm so lucky to have a friend like you. All my other friends are normal. <laughs> you know, some of us are not normal and we're fun. <laughs> and she's definitely fun. She's extraordinary, not normal. So anyway, I went in for one greeting card and I came out with all that stuff. I think there was more, but Taylor got some modeling clay. Um, I think, I guess that's all we got. We went to Dollar Tree, then we went by and picked up an order of groceries and then came home and had lunch since Grandma, I... did you already put the thank you, um, the thank you video on? For Francie? Yes, I sent that thank you video to Francie. Francie is another sub, another YouTube friend, and she sent the kids some Legos. I love them. And she loves hers, and Rhett loves his. Okay, guys, I'm going to go now. Stay with me. We're going to have some videos about a little place in New Mexico. We're going to have some videos about Route 66. Oh, we're going to have some of my favorite things. Another uh, lady I watched did... Um, um, a video on 10 of her favorite things around her house. Well, I'm going to do a bathroom edition and a kitchen edition and maybe some other editions. You never know. Ooh, you could do the balcony edition. Could. Bedroom edition. <laughs> okay, I got to go now. This is getting too long. Bye, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.